Hey guys, so yeah, I'm recording this on my computer and I'm using the mic for the sound. I'm guessing you can hear it. So yeah, you can see the treadmill, my bed's in made, I'm wearing my editing glasses. So currently right now I am editing my nano metal fig review and it's taking a really, really long time. So today I'm giving to you um, a combination of video footage of me opening them and so this kind of started around from before Christmas to today just it's just gonna hop everywhere so anyways yeah just just roll the footage we're gonna get you some friends hopefully guys could you please be quiet for like a little bit okay so here's another impromptu video like that Lego one I made the Lego dimensions one so I don't know if this is going to be added on to another video like a review or just another video like um like a Christmas unboxing stuff but like so you guys remember that I got this really cool Iron Man for a youth group uh white elephant and so you can't really see how cool he looks just through the camera but he's a really amazing guy he looks awesome it's it's hard it's hard to see how cool he looks through the on the computer but anyways so this is called a uh, uh, it's a metal nano fig. I think I called them nano metal figs in the last video, but so I got this one for my elephant, and I saw these ones beforehand, and I thought they were really cool, and I was glad to get one myself. So now I got some more, and my dad got me some for Christmas too that are really awesome. But so for now I got myself Spider Gwen, and then for my homeschool co-op I got a Star Lord one. Now Star Lord. Star Lord's not my favorite character for one, and two, he doesn't look as amazing as the other ones, so this wouldn't be a cool one for me to win and get it, but if I didn't get it, I'm, I'm fine, and someone else got a cool Star Lord. So, right now I'm opening the Spider Gwen. So, hold on, let me set this right here. As you can see, there's my Gundam from one of those older videos. And so, let's see, how do I open this? I'm gonna peel this. I got the Iron Man, by the way, without the package. Like, someone opened it and then put the Iron Man in. So this is the first time I'm actually opening the package of these. So, when this pulls out, you put this over here. And then, I can pop her out. Now, ah, Spider Gwen! She's really cold because it's Christmas time, no, duh. And so, yeah, she actually looks really awesome. I mean, look at that. She got some scruff marks on her? I can't tell. But yeah, so, I'm starting a collection, if you can't tell. So I picked out some with my dad that he's going to give to me for Christmas. So it's not going to be a surprise, but it is going to be really cool. So yeah, be sure to look forward to that. So here's, here's the start of a collection for you. So yeah, I'll keep, I'll keep you updated. So hello again. I realized that I'm going to make a review on these. So I don't know why I'm going to show you all of them right now. But so I wanted to keep... This one, and then two of the one packs for the review, and then like open the rest of them now. So I'm probably gonna open these two, but then I have like the rest of these. So yeah, this is from my dad, 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 dad. This is Doberman, dad, dad. I actually picked out this one, this one. You can't see vision, it's reflecting. This one, this one, this one, and this one, because Dad's like, which ones do you want? It's probably a better idea to get you what you want than get you something that's cool and st uh, you might not like as much as these ones. And then these two he knew I'd like because I liked the Iron Man so much. He had so much detail on huh? focus. I mean, look at that. Okay, the camera doesn't do it justice very well, but I thought it was awesome. So I wanted to get more Iron Man ones. I'm not Team Iron Man, I'm actually Team Captain America. It's kind of sad that I'm getting tons of Iron Man though. But yeah, I'm gonna open these two, and then I don't know which of these I wanna open. We will see, so. Uh, see, you wanna see my sink. How do I hold the, I've had this problem before. There, I pulled out the tripod, here we go. So this is Spider-Man Proto Suit. It's like the suit in Spider-Man Homecoming. Where the homemade one where he fights the vulture. So yeah, hold on, let me. Okay, let's open this bad boy. I don't know if it's better collector to save them than to open them, but I like these, so I'm just gonna open them. So here's Proto Suit's 
Spider-Man if I can get him out of this plastic thing. Oh my gosh. There we go. So here he is. All I'm showing you now, I guess this is kind of a vlog and then I'll do a review later. But yeah, so you got like the gold, the gold. Yeah, you got a hoodie. I can hear you guys whispering. It doesn't matter. You guys can talk. It's fine. I mean, this is Hulk. Just, I, Hulk's better than I would have ever thought. Because I'm not a huge Hulk fan. But look at that. Like, that looks just like the Hulk. And it's amazingly so. Let's just get him out. Let's just put him back in. Ah. There we go. This is... Yeah, it's kind of damaged. I don't need to know. So yeah, look at that. Looks really good. And then he has the red stripe from, like, Avengers Age of Ultron. They really got the shape of Hulk well. I also like Drax. I'm gonna open him later. So yeah. I've got Vision. War Machine. Stealth Suit Iron Man. Hulkbuster. I really want to open Stealth Suit Iron Man, actually. And then I'll open... Oh, so I, don't want to... I like these two. Okay, I'm going to open... Why do I need two? I can keep this one and this one for the review. Right here. Get this trash out of the way. Let's open Vision. Look at that. He's got this little dopey face because they, they painted his eyes kind of wrong. But other than that, he looks really cool. Yeah, the only problem with nan yeah, nano metal figs, I call them metal nano figs, but they're nano metal figs, is that they can't get faces really well. I'm going to cover that in my review. And like even if they got the eyes right, sometimes the faces don't look good. Actually, his face looks pretty good, other than the eyes, which are weird. Yeah, it's it's really fun. So here's Vision, and then I like both of these. I don't know which one I want to open. I'll open. I'll save this one because he's super awesome. Best for last, I'd say. I only open the War Machine, and save the two other Iron Man armors for later. So this is. Just War Machine. Actually, War Machine's pretty good, actually. Oh, he came out like the... E he's the easiest one that came out. Put him right there. Okay. I'm gonna put this like this. So yeah, as I said before, they don't do faces very well, so that's why I didn't really get a Captain America. Oh, wow. It actually looks really good. I'm looking at it through the camera, and I'm really surprised. Back doesn't have much to show, but it's because War Machine's mostly just gray on gray. Yeah, I got a whole team. What would be really funny is if I made a video with these guys in Army Men. I might do that, but I don't know if anyone would like that. So, yeah, comment below if you would like to see an Army Men video, stop motion or otherwise. So, yeah, this, this, is, this is my portion of collector's items I got for Christmas. Hey guys, so I'm um, I'm basically recording right now the review on metal nano figs. I ha I made this little Lego tripod thing, and I'm using this from my Thor Ragnarok Lego video to hold up some stuff. This is my mom's phone, and now it's low battery. Anyways, I'm going to unbox these right now. Before I continue on, I'm making it. I'm making separate unboxing video. If you can't tell, I realize looking back that I'm just gonna put all these unboxings together. So I'm gonna put this right here. Make it look like I'm doing this on purpose. So let's open stealth armor first. What's really funny is that. Okay, one. My sound is probably messed up. Oh, the mic is picking me up though. I'm gonna turn off the mic. Oh, that's probably not a good idea. So, nano, let's just say three. So, 
Yeah, my, my camera's probably making really terrible sounds with my voice. I'm very sorry. So, anyways, what's really funny about this character is even when he was in the box, I looked at him in the corner of my eye. Oh, apparently he's out. In the, in the corner of my eye, he looked a lot like Mega Man for some reason. So, yeah, he is basically, if you look at the other Iron Man, he's the same thing except blue. And if you can't tell, he has a slightly lighter tint on some of the gold parts of regular Iron Man. So let's put War Machine in there for fun. This is like Iron Man ones. And then, let's see in the background, we have Hulk Buster, which I have seemed to misplace. Oh, no, it's under the bed. All right, so let's open this. Now, and here is uh, here's the Hulkbuster. So the one arm is connected to the body, which is kind of weird. What's also strange is right here, Iron Man's arc reactor is white. Here, the Hulkbuster's yellow. Maybe it's not an arc reactor, I don't know. I didn't get to see the back much when it was in the packaging. Also, its feet are really detailed. That was kind of really stupid to look at, but whatever. So I got these ones open. Let's go on to the Guardians of the Galaxy ones. So, let's do this. I can't. Oh, yes, I can open it one-handed. That was actually really easy. Oh, yes. Now I just have to pull this out one-handed. I'm just going to rip the packaging. I don't care. Here they are. Dad, I can hear you. Yeah, now I can just take them out one by one. Just as much trouble. So here's Star-Lord. Go on, camera. Focus. So here's Star-Lord. He looks kind of strange, his face mask, but it's, it's metal and it's really small, so they couldn't mold it that well. The rest of them looks really cool, though. The padding, especially on his pants is really really good and the guns are like just look just like them wish there was more interestingness going on in the shirt like maybe like a ravager symbol or something but whatever baby Groot so here are the rest of them I'm gonna put Star Lord right here for good measure so first let's take a look at Mora. She's like the second main character. Now, if you even if the camera's not focusing, you can see that she her face is really weird, but it's kinda of because it's small, so they couldn't apply paint and also the molding is weird. Purple hair is also kinda of strange. Oh, you know, I guess it's slightly black and then a little bit purple. I guess that's pretty cool. I didn't notice that. So the purple you can't tell. But she has purple hair on the top, and then it's pink going down, so the purple's supposed to be black. She's got, like, gauntlet wristbands, like Wonder Woman. And her stance is... Okay, I guess her stance is okay. I thought her leg was bending in a weird way. Here is Baby Groot. I'm Groot. So, yeah, he actually looks gold, which doesn't really help that much. But the twig detailing looks like really awesome. Like his his torso looks like it's a twig, and he has the little fists, he has a little face. It's weird that he has a nose, but whatever. He's, he has a pot which actually has soil in it. It looks like, or maybe they just messed it up. And so then the rest of the figure is gray colored. Oh, cool. See, the rest of them don't have that little thing. If you look, they don't have little things. So anyways, here's Drax. Drax and Gru are exclusive characters to this one. Yo, Drax is probably my favorite out of the bunch. He's got really funny silver pants. Well, not silver, but, like, reflective red. And so, his tattoos are reflective red, which actually looks pretty cool. And then his face is kind of bland, but it's actually one of the best molded faces I've seen. It's got gauntlets and boots, and the bottom of his boots are dipped in red, which is a strange toy choice, actually. So, and then on to, finally, Rocket. It's not that it's best for last or bad for last. Rocket's just Rocket. I'm not a big fan of the Guardians of the Galaxy in general. I mean, I do like their movies, but as superheroes, I have, I have, I'm a bigger fan of Spider-Man than most other superheroes. But 
So yeah, Rocket looks really cool. He has his tail, and it's kind of attached to the um, base for stability. His gun is very detailed. His eyes, he doesn't appear to really have eyes actually, so it's kind of a bummer. But other than that, it's pretty cool. So yeah, I unboxed them all. I'm not sure if I'm going to get any more. If I do, I'll just make a separate video on that. So anyways, back to the review. I will see you in the review. And I will also see you in the next video. Goodbye.